welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new my name is Courtney and I'm very sorry I have not posted in a few weeks I've had a lot going on I've had um, family things just going on and my attention needed to be there instead of filming um, so I do apologize for that but I'm back and I'm very excited to film today um, I'm gonna be doing a just a productive day in my life basically um, I woke up super early. I had to drop my son off at daycare and then I had to go to um, get my depot shot. So I just got home, I got ready, and then now I'm going back out. I'm going to visit my grandma in rehab currently. Um, she just got out of the hospital, so she's in rehab for two weeks before she can come home. So I'm gonna go visit her, and then I'm gonna go to the grocery store, um, get a few things, and then, I don't know, I have a lot of stuff I have to do, and I have a phone call doctor's appointment at 4.15. Um, I just have a lot of different things I have to do. Hopefully I don't forget anything. I should probably make a to-do list. But if you like videos like this, consider subscribing. Um, like this video if you want to. Won't hurt my feelings. And um, let's just get into this video. I'm trying to balance you guys without you falling. This is an awful angle. I am so sorry, but I need to put lip gloss on. My lips look pale. Like really, really pale. Well, that that did not help. That just made it worse. This is the this is just um, a cheap lip gloss. It's Wet and Wild, right? I think no, it's Rimmel, and it's the Nonstop uh, Glamour. But um, I don't know. I'm probably now that um mask mandates are like not as serious anymore like you can go into the grocery store without a mask the only places you have to, and my job took the mask mandate away the only places you really have to wear them are doctor's offices so i think i'm gonna go buy some lipstick because i haven't worn lipstick since the pandemic because i never saw a point i was constantly wearing a mask and then it would get stuck on of course the mask but i really want to go get lipsticks um like nude colors not so much this just because it's very pale like my skin but I don't know we're gonna we're gonna go shopping for lipstick too I think I I think that's a that's a necessity for me right now I'm gonna I felt so confident before COVID was a thing when I could wear lipstick and like just do light makeup and go to work I felt so good about myself and I miss feeling that like confident boost when you wore lipstick like lipstick lipstick and mascara were the two go-to's yeah I think I'm gonna do that when I go to the grocery store <laughs> so let's see what I come out with all right so it's about an hour and a half later it's 102 um, I left my grandma I'm at the store I'm gonna get her some flowers and bring back to her um, and I'm also gonna get a few things that I need from the store um, I have a few other errands to run, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to get them all done in time before I have to go pick up Levi. So we'll find out what happens, but until then, let's go grocery shopping. I won't make it easy for you now. You got two minutes of my time. Slip into your dreams tonight. Oh, 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 so give me, so give me your all. I'll take it, I'll take it tomorrow. Hey guys so I'm back home for a minute I'm not gonna be here very long because I have even more running to do but after I went to Walmart I got gas um, and these are the flowers that I picked up for my grandmother she loves sunflowers my favorite flower is a sunflower my grandma's favorite flower is a sunflower and in their bouquet I found one single sunflower in this whole like little um, bouquet of flowers. I love the bright colors, but this really stood out and it was so perfect. Um, so I'm going to get a vase from my house, cut them up, put them in the vase and bring them to her. But I was so excited to see this because they only had one bouquet that had a sunflower in it and I wasn't even originally looking for one. I just wanted to get her some flowers and I saw these and I was like, oh my gosh, how perfect. 
So I got those. And then um, I did mention I was going to be getting like lipstick or something in that genre. I ended up not getting lipstick. I did get two lip glosses that I want to try just because I haven't worn lipstick in so long. I don't know what types of lipstick get stuck to your teeth. I don't like the liquid um, matte ones that like dry just because I feel like um, I feel like, I don't know, they just, they make my lips super dry and I don't want to keep putting chapstick on throughout the day. I don't know, I'll try it, but I wanted to start simple, so I got two different lip glosses. I got this one from Wet n Wild, and it's a very shimmery pink, I don't know if you guys can see it. Um, it's by the Zodiac Signs, um, I already have mine, and I bought it like a long time ago um but i wanted to try this one because i thought it was pretty it's the taurus one i also got covergirl and i love this one because it's um cruelty free um which i love it tells you on the back of the package but it's a very purpley plum color um i feel like because it's a lip gloss it won't apply so dark i know with lipsticks if you buy a dark lipstick it's going to be very dark but if you buy a lip gloss, it tends to be slightly less dark than what it looks like in the tube. So I want to try this one. I'm going to try it on in the house. And then I got um, e.l.f. E.l.f. is one of my favorite skin products. I love their makeup, but their skin products make my skin so hydrated, so moisturized, and like acne blemish free. Um, this is the eye cream holy hydration. I love the skin cream of this. So I wanted to try the eye cream Hopefully you guys can see this. I feel like it's too bright Maybe I should do the rest of this inside and then I got their elf skin toner with um, oat milk aloe um, juice and then I Don't know how to pronounce the last one. So I'm not gonna try but it's this kind of toner and I needed a toner. I've been out for a few weeks, but I hate buying toners just because they're so expensive. But I was like, I really need one. And it doesn't smell like anything, which is the good thing, because I don't like toners having fragrance in it. I don't think most of them do. But I've had a few frag or um, toners that had like a weird fragrance, and I love um, skincare to have fragrances, but not toners. So, so that's my little beauty haul, but I'll show you guys the rest of what I got when I get in the house. Look how pretty! Oh, I'm so excited to give them to her. And this was the bouquet that my fiance got for me. He got it um, a few days ago, but it had a bunch of sunflowers and um, roses. And I, I think, I don't know what this is. I think it might be a lily, but if you guys know, please let me know in the comments. But I thought the combo of colors was really pretty. So me and my grandma get to match. Okay, and now it is haul time. So starting with, um, you know, the things that I already showed you, now I can move on to Wyatt's bag. He's got Red Bull. Um, every week I have to get him Red Bull from the store and I didn't, so I had to go get some um, Alufa because he doesn't know how to change his um, loofah like a normal person. And yes, I'm calling you out, so if you see this video, love you. Um, I also got him razors, so I'm just going to leave these in the bag and he can do what he will with them. Um, but I also got a random mixture of things. I got a few things for dinner throughout this week. Um, and then I got some random miscellaneous things, like the skincare. Um, like first, I got taco seasoning. You got to have taco seasoning because me and him are going to be doing um, taco night where we basically break up. Doritos and like instead of having regular tacos we're gonna make a taco salad with Doritos so we're doing that I also got this big bag of stuff so I got some rolls for again some night for dinner I got the the shredded lettuce to do the taco salad bowl 
Um, I think we're doing that tonight. I think I want to do that tonight. Got strawberries because it's my son's favorite and I love strawberries. Wyatt likes them too. But Levi will eat the crap out of them. I also got um, broccoli cheddar soup of the Panera Bread one that they sell at the store. So I got this and I'm going to just take it to lunch with me for work this week. I got two cups of mac and cheese for, again, Levi or me for work. Um, usually he likes to eat the mac and cheese cups, but if he doesn't, I just bring him to work. And then this is also for dinner one night this week. It's the Italian Five Cheese, the Walmart version. Um, I tried the Gouda one and I really liked it, so I wanted to try that one. I got... So, one of my favorite YouTubers loves coconut water. I have tried coconut water many times and I can't get into it, but she's like swears by this one. It's the Harmless Harvest coconut water um, cold filtered and it's like a pinkish red color, which I thought was odd. So I wanted to try it. So I'll be doing a taste test of this today. But if you guys know who Bebe Hay is, her name is Haley. Um, she's like one of my favorite YouTubers um, and she swears by this. So I really want to try it. I also got a monster, which I know is super unhealthy. I know, please don't come at me in the comments. Um, Walmart didn't have any of my energy drinks, which is a Lonnie, which is a lot healthier. So I got a monster, but I only got one. I didn't get like a whole week's worth. And then I got the mild Pico de Gala, Gala, it's Pico. I got it for um, uh, tacos tonight. I think I'm gonna do that tonight. And then I got, the last thing was, I just got a big thing of chicken because I still have quite a bit of meat left. But I just needed, like, because I want to make orange chicken for white this week. He loves, like, uh, Chinese food, so I like making it homemade. So I got chicken breast, and I'm going to split it up and stuff. But um, that's everything in my little haul. And, guys, I spent $100. All of this, the small stuff, came to $100. The prices are getting so ridiculous, but it's like, it is what it is. You got to deal with it, but oh my goodness, a hundred dollars for this small little grocery haul. Okay. I just finished putting all the groceries and whatnot up. I'm going to try this. I'm actually kind of nervous just because my encounter with coconut water has not been great. And everybody talks about how healthy it is for you, but I know people who really love it or really hate it. But I'm gonna give it a try. I don't, I don't know. Sorry if you can hear my dog in the, the background. She's outside right now and she's chasing a ball and she'll do it for hours. Hours. That one definitely is better. I was surprised. I still can taste like the coconut water. Like it's got a distinct taste, but it tastes different from the other ones I've tried. I could actually drink this one. I probably wouldn't drink it often just because this little bottle was almost $5. But yeah, I'm, I could see why Haley was like raving about this. Mm-hmm. Not bad. I think I want to try that lip gloss now. I really want to try it because like I tried a different one and it's really pink on me, but I just want to, I want different colors. I feel like I have a lot of nudes and I have a lot of off pinks, but I, I want to try something that's a little more risque or bold. I don't know, but I think I'm going to go try it. I have this one again, very pink, but um, I thought the color was so pretty, so I think I'm going to try both of them. In front of you guys. This one's almost off my lips, so I'm just going to try it right now. It's very pink. Like, the applicator is very pink. I don't know if you can see it. Anyways. It's very similar to the one that I put on. 
I don't think it's um, bad at all. I think it's very subtle and it would be like a good lip gloss to apply at work or just to keep in my purse. So I think this is going to be my go-to one. But I still want to try the other one. So one second. Alright, so this is very like, it's a very plummy color. Doesn't have a number on it, but this is what it looks like. I love the packaging. I just think it makes me feel very like royal aesthetic. I don't know. Oh, that's dark. That that's dark. So I don't know how this is gonna look. I thought it was more plum. And it's a limited edition. I thought it was more of a plum color. So now it's looking brown to me. I don't know. You can't even see it. I think it made my lips slightly darker. I think they look a little bolder. I really like it. I would actually keep this in my purse too. One, it's, okay. So compared to these two, this you can tell is a lip gloss. It's very pretty. Um, you probably have to reapply it every few hours. Um, but this one, again, you all lip glosses you have to reapply. But this one is like creamier. It's not as sticky. And that's like the one thing in lip glosses that kind of irritate me is how sticky they can be because I have longer hair. So it's like anytime the wind just goes, it like, you know, it wants to stick to my lips. But I like both of them, but I love the smell of this one. It's got a very nice smell and it's very creamy. So I was not expecting that. And I love the color. I really thought it was going to be darker. It's not though. I don't... You would not think this color... It doesn't match, so I don't get it. Maybe it's just like... But it's not a clear gloss. You would think there would be a little bit of tint. It made my lips a little darker, but not the color that's in the tube. That's what I said earlier. That's why it's like, lipsticks, you know what you're gonna expect, but lip glosses, you really never know until you try them. But I'm gonna put both of these in my purse because I'm a fan. Lip glosses and mascara is like my thing. I like highlighter too, but. All right, I think I'm going to get my grandma's flowers situated in a vase and then I'm going to bring them back to her. And then Wyatt should be home soon because we're gonna go on a little date and get some boba. Um, so I'm letting my dogs play outside for a minute and yeah, I think that's the plan for right now. Are you guys all tired? You just played outside for a little bit. Are you tired? You're like, no mama. I got all the energies. I got all the energies. Ah! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I love you guys. I love you. I know I love you. Say hi, Max. Say hi, Lilo. Hi, baby. What are you doing? You want to say hi? No, but Max does. The Max does. how beautiful it looks I'm so excited to bring it to her and I made sure the sunflower is like popping out so that's the first one she'll notice all right I'm here it is 3 13 I'm gonna bring the flowers in um, and I'm really excited to see her so let's see what her reaction is it's now four o'clock. Um, I was gonna film um, seeing her reaction, however, didn't wanna disrupt um, the lady she's sharing a room with because she was sleeping, so I didn't want to make her uncomfortable or wake her up, so I was trying to be quiet. So I just brought the flowers in. She loved them, she was so excited. We talked for a little bit, um, and then I'm back in the car. 
So I'm gonna go back home. I have some laundry I have to do. And hopefully Wyatt's back home so that we can go on our little date to get Boba because we have to go pick up Levi by six and it's already four. I won't make it easy for you now. You got two minutes of my time. Super, super nice outside. It's very bright, but it feels so good. I might need to take off my hoodie because the weather is just too nice. It's really starting to feel like spring. I'm home! Hello, everybody! Max and Milo. Wow, it's super bright in here. Such good lighting. Ooh. Now that I'm home though, I really need to do laundry and wash the dishes. Just because I don't like having a sink full of dishes knowing that I have to make dinner, wash the dishes after, and then wash more dishes. So um, also, it's really dark over here, so I want to open the curtains. I don't know if it'll make much of a difference, but... Bright light. So, yeah, I'm probably going to start on the dishes because um, I can't have the washer going at the same time that my faucet's going. So, dishes it is. First, I have to put away all that. So, wish me luck. like 10 minutes worth of cleaning but it seemed to help a lot um i vacuumed did dishes and laundry and now me and wyatt are going to go get boba i also changed my jacket because it started getting super hot it was in like the 50s and 60s this morning and now it's almost 80. florida weather i'll slip into your dreams tonight oh so we're outside of Levi's daycare. I'm waiting for them to come out. But we went on our little date. We didn't actually have time to sit or anything. We had to take it to go because we had to pick him up um, from daycare before six. And the little tea shop is in Inverness and we live in Crystal River, so. But he doesn't know I'm in the truck, so I'm excited to see his reaction. He always gets super excited when he sees me coming. So, uh, yeah. I'm gonna, gonna wait for him to come out. That. Hi, Bubby. Look at that Good smile. <laughs> Look at your hair. Let me get your bag. Get up there. Come on. I'm going to be your instructor for your online Nope. Online no, no, no. Uh, Welcome to the class. Go, Hi. Wait. Until now, I didn't know what to do. We still got a haircut. It looks so good. Daddy cut it up real nice, huh? You just gotta style it. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna call it a night. Levi has his hair cut, and it's time for him to go to bed. It's really late. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I love you all so much. And until next time, bye. Gee, bye bye. He's not interested. I'll stick like glue inside your mind. Just watch me break in. 
Your fun.